poverty in Africa is predominantly rural, and there's ample evidence that 70% of the continent's poor people live in poorly organized rural areas which are often isolated and beyond the reach of social safety nets and poverty reduction programs. Well, we're discussing the MasterCard Foundation Fund for Rural Prosperity. It's quite verbose and we're looking at this fund in total and exactly how they carry out their mission. My guest is Dr. George Menu. He's a partner with KPMG. Um, you're welcome, sir. Thank you. So the obvious question, I suppose, is the most frequently asked everywhere you go. What is this master? It's so verbose. MasterCard Foundation Fund for Rural Prosperity. Um, the MasterCard Foundation Fund for Rural Prosperity is a $50 million US dollar fund that seeks to support and scale up innovative ideas uh, for smallholder agricultural farmers and other economically disadvantaged groups. The idea really is to expand financial services to these people. So there's some financial inclusion there? Absolutely. It's all about financial inclusion. Okay, so exactly how do you go about this? Because I'm looking at an MDG report which indicated that extreme rural poverty in Ghana continues to deepen mm. regardless of efforts exerted into poverty um, alleviation programs in rural areas. Mm. So exactly how different is the approach you take? Right. You're right. Uh, poverty continues to deepen uh, despite prosperity, as it were, of various countries. You know, it hasn't quite spread. Uh, to the poor, if you like. In so, rural areas. And particularly in rural areas. And agriculture is one of the most vulnerable of, of those. So how do we go about this? We use a challenge fund. Um, a challenge fund is essentially a competition uh, where you accompany companies or beneficiaries, spread the risk with them, and basically help the winners to achieve set challenges. So in this case, the challenge is financial inclusion. And, that, and, and so the competition is saying, how do you address financial inclusion? And we ask companies to give us their ideas as to how they, they, they will go about it. So is the competition open to exactly whom? The competition is open to several um, entities, so banks, non-bank financial institutions, agribusinesses, IT and telco operators, insurance companies, and so on. Um, the idea being to get them to extend their financial products and services to the rural poor. And for how long has this competition or fund, I probably would use them interchangeably. Can I? You could. Yes. It's a fund, yeah. but we operate the fund through competitions. Okay, so for how long has the competition been ongoing? The, the fund started last year, 2015. Okay, so essentially, the MasterCard itself? No, the MasterCard Foundation itself. We need to distinguish yes, between clearly, please. the MasterCard. <laughs> the yes. MasterCard is a company. They yes. issue the credit yes. cards. I suppose, and they are the source of the 50 million US dollars? Indeed. Okay. Now, they have a foundation, okay. which is a separate legal entity. We mm. need to stress that. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the foundation, the MasterCard Foundation, is the source of the funding. Okay. Uh, they themselves have been established for 10 years. So they were set up in 2006. And uh, to date, they have um, invested about 600 million US dollars in financial inclusion in Africa. In Africa? In, Africa. in rural Africa? Mostly. Mostly. And this fund is 50 million US. Wait, this, I, I like the sound of that. I like to hear about a lot of money. Let's talk about the first editions of the, the earlier editions of the competition. When did those take place? Uh, 2015. So we ran two competitions last oh, year. Oh, last year. Um, and so far this year, we have done one. We just closed and just launched the fourth um, last week. Okay. And that's running until the 10th of June. Okay, and all the 50 million US dollars will be disbursed within what period? Um, we, expect to, we expect to commit all the 50 million in three years. Okay, so what, what are the likely entrants you know, into this competition? 
Based I am eager. My father is a is a herbal medicine practitioner. Right. And well, I know you're talking about financial inclusion, but I suppose he can lend a quota. He's a herbal medicine practitioner. He mm. has nomino bitters. His company is Tabitha Herbal Center. Mm. Does he qualify? Does he meet the criteria for selection? I'm sure your dad would love you for the advert. Yes, that he's yes, he loves me anyway. Um, yeah. He could, because yeah. agribusinesses, and, and I suppose you could classify him as an yes, agribusiness. Yes, because it's herbal. Right, yeah. agribusinesses qualify. The important thing, though, is that you should be extending financial services and products to the marginalized groups. In other words, if, for example, he partnered with a bank or microfinance institution or insurance company or a telco or an IT provider, then it could work. Um, so the key, you know, if, if, you, if you go back to the, the rationale for this, um, two thirds of the workforce in Ghana and the rest of Africa are in agriculture. Um, commercial bank lending accounts for 1% um, to agriculture, commercial bank lending to agriculture, to agri accounts for 1% okay. of the total. Or oh, agribusiness, agriculture-related businesses. Basically. Yeah. So what you find, therefore, is that agriculture in particular um, is really starved okay. of finance. Okay. Okay. And this is where the majority of the poor yeah. live. So this project okay. is really trying to address. Okay. So how many winners did we have in the last competition? We had five out and of 170. Oh, that's a host of them. Yes. And, and how much money was disbursed amongst the five? They, we've committed 10.6 US, 10.6 million US, US dollars. dollars. So on the average, one company takes about 2.1 2.2? Yes. Yeah. For that competition, the maximum was 2.5 million. Okay. So the minimum is three quarters of a million, okay. 750,000 okay. to 2.5 so, million. So they adopt a, a particular rural area in a country or they can move be, you know, outside the, their country of operation? Okay, let me give you an example yes. of one winner. Yes. So you, you have a company called M Copper, okay. Okay, which is a Swahili word. M is mobile. Copper means to borrow. Okay. Um, so you have a company called M Copper who are basically into solar energy, okay? And the way it works is they come and install the equipment for you. Okay. And you pay something like 50 cents a day over a period. Period. And then after that, you own that equipment. Yes. And you top up your, mob your, your energy, your power, with your mobile phone, basically. So after a year, you've paid for this, okay. this system. You now have electricity. Okay. You can charge your phones. You have, a, you have lights. That sounds amazing. Have some of these projects been implemented? Yes. yes. They've started. Or oh, you've disbursed some, mon some monies already? Uh, for the first competition we ran last year, we've disbursed. Okay. For the latest winners, okay. we have yet w to Were disperse. there any Ghanaian companies? Because I suppose the competition is open to companies from the, the continent over. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Were there for any winning Ghanaian companies? There were. So for the initial competition, which yeah. was the innovation, yeah. we had two companies from Ghana. And even for the latter one, the scaling competition that we've just announced, yes. there was a Ghanaian winner. Yes. But the MasterCard Foundation felt their product was more in the innovation window than in the scaling up. So what we've done is park them for now. So they have already if you like, pre-qualified okay. for the, for the in, next, for the next yes. innovation window. Okay. Um, so when you look at the five, you won't see a Ghanaian in there, but that's okay. because we took the Ghanaian company. Okay. But otherwise, are there rural areas in Ghana that stand to benefit from these projects? All of these projects are touching rural areas. Okay. All of these projects. No, but in Ghana, I mean. Yes, yeah. the, the ones okay. that won in, okay. the, in the innovation okay. Okay. are going to touch rural areas okay. in a big way. Quickly, so how, how does a company enter? Uh, very simple. They go online uh, to www.frp, F for fund, R for rural, P for prosperity, dot org. So frp.org, okay. and there they will be able to read all about it, download the okay. form, fill it in, okay. submit it. Must, must a company that seeks to enter have been in existence for a period, you know? 
In theory, you could have startups. For. In okay. theory, you yeah. could have startups, uh -huh. um, although it's more difficult okay. uh, because you don't have a track record. Yes. You don't have anything really to show. Yeah. Um, but yes, in theory, you could. But the majority are existing businesses already. Okay. Yeah. But it's all stated there um, on the website. It is. All yes. the information you need to know okay. to apply is on there. Thank you. I am very interested. I'm speaking to my father immediately. You if should. He's not watching already. Okay. After all, it's agro-based. It's, 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 it's agro-business. Agro it's, it's, it's herbal. Tabitha um, Herbal Company is. Right. Yeah. And one of the things we particularly encourage is partnership. So, for example, if he could partner with a financial institution or a telco or an insurance company, then you have the makings of a very strong Thank you. Proposal. Thank you. Perhaps next time you should come with some of the, the winning companies and let's see how they, they intend going about their, their missions, their I objectives. Would. If yes. you invite me yes. next time. No, I'll you're warmly invited. Just one. let us know when you're ready. Thanks. Thank you very much. I've been speaking to Dr. George Menu, KPMG um, partner, and we've been talking, well, we've been discussing the, that's very verbose, the MasterCard Foundation Fund for Rural Prosperity. And so if you're interested, you can visit their website, www.frp.org. It's as simple as that. Everything else is on the website. Thank you. Um, you're watching New Day.